Today I'm with the Myers family and um, they've agreed to tell us a little bit about what's going on in their house. And so um, I appreciate um, that. I'll let, why don't you guys introduce yourself and say what grade you're in so everybody knows. Okay, we'll start with the oldest. I'm Landon and I'm a freshman. I'm Braden and I'm a sixth grader. In town, I'm the fourth grade. And who are you? <laughs> this is Grayson, and he's in kindergarten. Awesome. So we've got a mall. And of course, Marie's with us as well as a mom. So what have you guys learned about yourself or school since we started this quarantine? And anybody can answer. Go, Landon. I need sports to keep me busy. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Anyone else? They say the same. Yeah. Same. They like the sports. <laughs> the sports. Yeah. I hear you. That routine. Uh, how about you, mom, Marie, anything that you've sort of learned about yourself or school since? Um, uh... No, I think that I've learned that I'm very grateful for teachers <laughs> and they're so underpaid because it's a lot of work, you know, gathering all the lessons and, you know, things for the kids to do. And I can imagine that it's even harder doing it through e-learning because yeah. you're having to make videos if you're doing videos and finding, you know, the resources to give the kids so that it makes it easier for them at home. Yeah, yeah, totally agree. It's Again, my, my morning has been spent and I just jumped off early uh, one webinar to kind of do this and mm -hmm. got uh, several more of these. So yeah, I, it, it's, it's, it's a different lifestyle, that's for sure. And we've sort of had to adjust to that. Um, and, you know, I can't imagine how difficult it is. You know, you've got four young kids and you haven't, you know, you everyone in every grade. Yeah, yeah that's a lot <laughs> going a lot. on. Wow. Wow. Um, what do you miss? Uh, I'm sorry. What have you learned from others about adapting to the quarantine? Anyone? Mm, what have you learned from others? Probably stay home and not go out. Like not go out. To stay, stay home and not go out. Yeah. For the sports guys, I've kind of really um, enjoyed seeing ESPN and all the different trick shots and the things yeah. that <laughs> kids and athletes are. Dude, that's been fun to watch. Yes. Yeah. We're, we're hoping for warmer weather so we can be outside more because we like to be outside. So have you guys done anything goofy like that or set up any, um, I don't know, um, you know, anything along those lines that you've tried? Like around the house and stuff. Oh, yeah, the oh, obstacle yeah, course. Yeah. The obstacle course. That's yeah. what they did. So. Okay, cool, cool. We, something similar, so. We froze for a second, so that'll be part of it. But that's, you know, kind of what this is all about. Yeah. Is yeah. To take it all in. Um, so what do you guys do to, or sorry, what do you miss most about staying at home? Did I ask that question already? No, I'm, not, I'm no, losing track. Okay, okay. Definitely, like, baseball, because it was just getting started. Yeah. And yeah. our first game was supposed to be the 16th, so it would have been that Monday. Yeah. Anything else? What else do you miss about school, not being in school? Uh, I get to see your friends. Yeah. Get to see your friends. Yeah, we miss our friends. Stop. What do you guys do to take care of yourself? I've been running. Quarantine yourself in my room. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good way to take That's care of yourself. <laughs> I There's love that of, answer. Um, a lot of video games, which Fortnite, yeah, Fortnite is a big one in our house and the basketball games and things like that. But you don't like to see them on that as much, but survival. When we, when we are busy, we're not on it. So right now we're not busy. So I'm kind of letting it slide a little bit. Yeah. So does so with like Fortnite, for example, I've never played it. Is are you able to connect to other friends and stuff like that and able to talk to people through yeah. the different uh so yeah. or the different softwares? Yeah, yeah. Nice. that so probably like, helps. Yeah, so I'm like, yes, like I can play on PS4, Grayson can play on Xbox, and Tom play on Nintendo Switch, and we can all play together. <laughs> gotcha, gotcha, <laughs> clever, clever. 
That's yeah, that's that's survival. That's what we're learning to do. Yes. Is there anything the district can do to help you guys out uh, more? Are you guys good? Do you I think don't pull up the daily challenges? <laughs> you can say that. You can tell them. You can tell them. Mm. He said to not have the daily challenges anymore <laughs> that Mr. Hosey's doing. Because oh gosh. It's fun. It's fun. Yes. I think it was funner when we weren't doing e-learning. Gotcha. But okay. now that we have, you know, well, me having two in elementary yeah. school yeah. plus the curriculum, it's a lot. And even if they are easy, it, I mean, it's yeah. still a lot. Yeah. And for them, it, for kids, I mean, they were just thrown into it. It's a little bit, it's hard for adults to adjust, but I think for kids, it's a little bit more. They don't understand everything that's going on as well as we do, but um, I would definitely say shorten some of the workload. Gotcha. Loud and clear. Um, some of like the elementary. And then I would say like um, in regards to the elementary, the social aspect of it, you know, we have um, something with Miss Moyman. I don't think that should be part of the curriculum because it's not a special that we do. So I don't think that should be a thing that we have. And again, the, the challenges. I think we should yeah. be done with the challenges because my kids hate losing. So, oh man! <laughs> if you don't win the what? If you don't win the day, then they're mad. But then they don't want to do it mm -hmm. because it's an extra thing that they have yeah. to do. Yeah. So. Well, there's yeah, there's grace there with that one. Thanks. I again, I we appreciate the feedback. So, sure. um, thank you. Uh, have you guys found a favorite social media post or? Anybody you're following that you're like, wow, I didn't know about this. And this has been fun to sort of learn about. I think the only one really would be Landon that would be on like on the social media part of it. Landon, is there anybody you're, you've been sort of following or watching? Found this guy goes to a lot of baseball games. That's about a <laughs> sport. Sorry. I found, uh, I've really liked the, um, late night sports or net late, late night sports, the uh, late night talk show guys like Jimmy Fallon. I love oh, yeah. his, his show from home. It's been a lot of fun. Um, yeah. They have, they have to make you laugh. For sure. And the concerts and some of those things, it's been fun to kind of check yeah. out and do the differently. Cool they watch the video game tournaments. Like, okay. Twitch like playing. Yeah. And we've been doing a lot of um, Marvel movies. That's okay. like our family thing right now. So. Or is there a uh, Netflix or a different um, TV thing that you guys have picked up? Just the Marvel. Like, we've been watching them in order. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. And there's how many? 23. A lot. Yeah. 23 movies. Wow. And we are um, we just finished Black Panther the other night. So wow. we have six left. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I mean, Grayson yeah. likes it, so. Yeah. Do you have a favorite? Um, I was, I like the Iron Man ones, but I thought Black Panther was cool. I like, uh, yeah, Andy said that was probably his favorite one was Black Panther. So, well, I'll wrap this up. What okay. advice do you have for fellow steamers who are, uh, you know, trudging along and trying to stay positive during this time? Hmm. I don't know. No. No. Uh, stay at home so we can leave the house. <laughs> stay at home uh, so I we like can that. leave the house. Yeah. Smart. Yeah. Yes. I would just say, you know, hang in there. We're all in the same situation. It's, you know, moms, you know, and people who are working all dealing with the e-learning thing, you know, do what you can. And if it doesn't get done, there's always the next day and find positives, you know, with all of this. I think the best positive that we've had is, being able to sit around the dinner table and doing the Marvel movies. I think that they'll always remember that. So I, you know, just find the positives and hang in there. Hopefully. Yeah. I, yeah. That's a good message. And I, I would just echo with when it comes to the schoolwork, it is important, but your family comes first. Sure. Yep. Yep. Try and do your best. And the teachers are outstanding. You know, they're willing to help in any way that they can. So, you know, just reach out to the teachers if you have issues. Yeah, agreed. Well, again, guys, thank you so much. This has been the Myers family and our steamer to steamer succeeding the quarantine. Appreciate you guys doing this and have a wonderful day. Hey, you too. Thanks. You bet.
Bye bye, bye. guys. Bye. bye.